It's the difference between being hit with a stick or being hit with a feather. This is the cellular conversation that's happening with the cells and muscles right now. It's a nano curve. I could ask you to dinner in Italian, you may not understand what's happening, but if I ask you in English, I'm speaking your language, we're gonna get to the same place at the same time, okay? That's the theory. There you go. So that's the theory. We're having a conversation with the nerves, the muscles, we're making it all happen. You're ready to step up here right here, right, young lady. Now let's do the measurements. Now, we want you guys to understand that when she came to us, you know, she was kind of like, you know, the Jared on the Subway commercial? She was extremely obese, okay, when she showed up here. I mean, and the girl obviously has an obesity problem, okay? But we're gonna still do the before. That's right. And she and she was very pale when she came here. She, she's, she's tan. That's because of the breathing. It's like a steam thresher, okay? The breathing makes you tan and, uh, and the inches go away. But we are gonna do the before and after measurements. We do an upper waist, waist, and a lower waist measurement. And even on, on somebody that's incredibly young and fit and healthy, we're gonna see a pretty significant difference. We're gonna show you the real same stuff. Now, if you could stand here before, you know, you can see where the where the, the, the marks are, where the pads are. You can see physical tightening, okay? But now we're gonna do a measurement just from her reference point to show her what she's lost. Now, obviously, if you have people that have a very high BMI, there's more there to work with, there's a little more fat to burn, we'll see people that'll get two to three to four inches, okay? But that's enough to get you excited, and it's certainly enough to get you to come back, and it's enough to get you to come back with a friend. Okay? That's what we're talking about. How do you feel? A lot of people say they feel like they've they just taken a swim. People swim a lot. People feel like they just kind of got off a treadmill. You do get a little fair and more rush because you did burn some fat. But you get a little bit more excited when you start looking at the tape. We're measuring her rib cage, essentially. Maybe here, yeah. 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 Well, and this is why the other young lady who's letting us do her legs and arms, because guys, there is no option for the, for the arms. You know, those of us who have the wings can't get rid of them. We can't operate on them because the surgery is going to leave a worse scar than the sagging of the arms to begin with. So when we start to tighten up the arms, that's a pretty big thing for people. You know, when they get tightened, they get toned, it's, it's a pretty dramatic uh, feeling. How does it feel on the legs? 